All right, everybody. It's right hand twist here. I'm gonna do a unboxing video here. A legit unboxing and first reaction video to some new moto boots I bought. I, um, I have a pair of Reebok work boots. Um, they're from the Reebok work line. They have a reinforced toe, a reinforced steel shank um, in the sole. And I use those a lot for dual sport riding, street riding around town, stuff like that. Um, just kind of goofing off riding. Then I also have like a pair of full moto um, boots that I wear when I know we're going to go hard. So I have those. But I didn't have anything like intermediary. Um, I wanted like a dual sport adventure type boot, um, but something that wasn't gonna break the bank. Um, so I kind of shopped around, found something I like online. Um, never seen them in person, never seen a pair, don't know anybody that has a pair. Um, I couldn't find really any information about them but they're made by um i don't know who they're made by i guess we'll find out but they're branded as um being made by tour master um i don't know if any of you are familiar with tour master but they make um, jackets helmets or actually i don't know if they make helmets but um jackets rain gear they make some bags like saddle bags soft bags things like that um but a lot of jackets uh, riding gear basically um, so I found a set of boots that um, hydrate remember always hydrate people I found a pair of boots that are uh, kind of looked like along the lines of what I wanted but just didn't want to spend the money for it. so here it is legit like I said an official unboxing just got it today. Headaches dropped it off. These are, um, like I said, they're um, from Tour Master. Like for me, I like the Forma, those Forma boots. The I like a lot of the more adventure style boots. Um, just because I like them. I like the way they look. I like to be able to be off the bike. Because I do a lot of dual sporting, camping, exploring. Stuff like that. I did find these on the damn Amazon of all places. All right, here they are. Let's see. Okay, so they came from um, a place called Helmet House. I've never ordered a helmet from them. Who knows? Uh, but here they are. Let's see. Get them out of this box. They're from Tourmaster. Tourmaster makes great jackets. Um, there they are. Tour Master. Um, we're going to see what these are all about here. I ordered a size 12 and a half. There they are on the box right there. You can see them on the box. They look kind of. I ordered the tan, the uh, brown and black leather. They come with like moto buckles and four seals. I uh, mean, you know, Souls and all of the works, you know. I uh, remember, like I said, hydrate. All right, I'll open it facing you guys so you can be first to see. Uh, all right, whoa, can't see anything. Oh, wow, I really like that. All right, oh, I haven't got them out of the box yet. I like it. Okay, here you go. Here it is. It's actually a uh, pretty damn nice looking boot, I must say. Get all that crap out of the way. It, just holding it right now feels pretty good. It's, um, oh, I like that. So you can check it out. These are the, um, what are they called? Trailblazer. These are the Tourmaster Trailblazer. Okay, let's get in there a little closer and look at that. They got moto buckles. It's a nice lugged sole. Well, not quite lugged, but 
Got some tread on there a little bit. Looks like it'll be all right. For... I wanted something I can get off the bike and walk in, walk around, set up camp. I do a lot of moto camping. So they got the buckles. I'm... I like that Horizon Line Tour Master. It does say they're waterproof. Um, they feel pretty solid. They got this uh, reinforced section here over the ankle. Both sides. Both sides, it's on there. Um, let me get the other one out of the box. I'm digging it, really, to be honest. It's got the protection on, the, on, the, on top of the boot. Protection on the side. This is like a suede, almost. Some sort of leather. Um, it's got this cool little, like, uh, snake skin kind of... I don't know if you can see that. See the, the patterns in there? It's kind of cool. They're definitely pretty solid. I really like it. It says it's a 12 and a half. I mean, that's the size they're supposed to be. I gotta slip them on. I don't have any socks on or anything, but I am gonna slip these jokers on just to see how they feel. Fast. There's the other one. Okay, same thing. Great boot, man. Look at that. The shift protection on the top, same thing. With the reinforcement in the sides right here, you can see it kind of bulges out there a little bit. Both sides are like that. Let's see what these clips are all about. They are very similar to standard, you know, motocross um, buckles. So let's see. Uh, let's pop open pretty good. They are adjustable, fully adjustable. There's a button right there, release probably. Where they just pull out. Ah, nice Velcro, secure flap on there. Oh yeah, they're waterproof. They got a waterproof protection, you know, interior protection there all the way. A lot of protection, I mean, a lot of padding in these things. Wow, I'm really digging this boot, y'all. <laughs> I'm for real. All right, here we go. We're just rigidity. Let's see what it's all about. Let's buckle it back up. Okay, the buckle's got two different. Let's see if you can even see that. It's two different notches, grooves. You can put the. Uh, oh, let's try on that one better. Yeah, see, so you can. Um, Put it in the first notch there, or the second one there. Okay, they latch pretty good. All right, let's see what they're all about. Do they flex how much? I mean, they've got flex in them, but... Yes, uh, some. But, man... I'm digging this boot. All right, I'm gonna slip this thing on, you guys. All right, I will too, tell you too, these boots, they were cheap. You know what they say sometimes, buy cheap stuff, you get cheap stuff. But like I said, Tour Master, they're, they're known in the motorcycle world for making great, um, you know, great gear, riding gear. The boots feel awesome. They're only like, they're not full like height as a motocross boot. Um, I wear a size 12 normally. Um, but of course, you know, we all wear, we wear moto socks. So you're wearing a sock that's a little big on the foot. Um, I mean, it's a little thick. Especially now, going into warmer weather. It's a good song coming on. Right. Let's see how they feel. Wow. That feels great, you guys, I'm telling you. Wow. That's a comfortable feeling boot right there. Uh, see how it feels? I don't like the way the... Ooh, yeah, 
Yeah, I don't like the way the weatherproof, waterproof flap folds over. I'm not a big fan of that. It's like a lot of excess. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like a lot of excess flap there. You don't need all that. So all that excess kind of has nowhere to go. Fills up the interior of the boot. It's uncomfortable tucking it to that side. I mean, it'll work. Let's buckle them up. See how they feel. Just got this one on. Fits great. Wow. I like it. Oh, they feel really good. Oh, nice. I'm digging the boots, y'all. They feel great. This boot feels really good. Chore master. I haven't put the other one on yet, but here it is. I got one on the foot already. And, I mean, it feels good. They f these feel better than a lot of the other boots I've tried. I've tried boots at Cycle Gear, um, Alpine Star makes a pair kind of like this. Um, like I said, it, it's it's a good boot. Look at that. I'm digging the. Um, this is like a. This here is like a leather. It's I mean, it's exactly what it is. It's a suede leather or something. Same thing with the the, the protection on the top of the boot. So, yeah, I'm going to wear these this weekend, probably. I mean, I know I'll wear them this weekend. I'm going to go ride somewhere. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of riding just to break them in and see how they feel. Um, but so far, just from having one on my foot, putting them on, and uh, seeing how they fit and feel, um, I like them. I'm going to ride with them. I'll give a couple rides. I'll come back and do a review as to how they feel and how they fit. Um, once I kind of break them in just a little bit, get some shifting down on them, stand up on the peg, see how they feel. See how that sole feels. Uh, I mean, look at that, the sole is... Uh, uh, yeah. Because see, you don't want... That's exactly what you want. You want... You want a stiff sole. Something when you stand up on them damn bear pegs, like on that KTM 500 back there, those things will eat up some boots, some shoes. So you want to have something good on your feet. And there we are. I will be back in a week or two, maybe, with a review, how they feel, everything. So that's it. These are the Tourmaster Trailblazer boots. So far, I think they're great. The quality is very good, and we're gonna give them a we're gonna give them a send. So that's it. Right hand twist out. That's our unboxing video. Um, we'll be back soon with a review. How they do.